Iran on Sunday unveiled a slew of electronic warfare and other electronic systems to disrupt enemy drones and provide protection to its own drones over enemy territory. These products developed by the Iranian Army Ground Forces Research and Self-Sufficiency Jihad Organization were unveiled during a ceremony held Sunday. Equipment revealed during the event include a system for drone radar warning with the capability to detect and jam airborne surveillance radars on a variety of drones, helicopters, and fighter jets. Also, a system to warn of the laser beams emitted from drones was unveiled today which enjoys the capability to detect laser-guided weapons and airborne threats, short-range air defense systems, including high-powered laser destroyer, and the ability to send alerts to the drone's ground control and guidance station, semi-official FARS news agency reported. Iran's Army Ground Force also showcased micro-turbojet engine which can be used in drone systems, single-seater light aircraft, wave gilders, various missile systems, and can be utilized in propulsion engines and for launching the main engines of aircraft. It provides low weight, high speed and high flight ceiling compared to piston engines and the ability to carry cargo and increase flight duration in a variety of UAVs and using a variety of fuels or other capabilities of the system. The next product was TIEM-1400 Drone Self-Defense System, Detection and Tracing of Guided Radars and Air Surveillance of Enemy Drones. The system operates in all frequency bands and is capable of detecting various types of air surveillance radar signals and intelligently transmits the received signal to the jamming system. Another system unveiled on Sunday was Mass Flight Network-based flight system based on artificial INTELLIGENCE AI, which consists of a leading drone follow-up drones and a ground station that has the ability to perform online or scheduled operations. Also, missions to identify, monitor and destroy enemy ground and flying targets, appropriate operational range and flight duration, the ability to network three or more aircraft by using a variety of Iran-made drones with a secure link and a completely indigenous control guidance system or other capabilities of the system. Meantime, another product was Taha 1400, a jamming system of air surveillance radars mounted on drones which is a system with appropriate power and covers a large operational area by using directional antennas and maintains the security of various drones flying over the enemy zones. Also, it is intelligent, is low in weight and voltage consumption, and has the ability to be installed quickly and easily. The next product was upgraded ground-based jamming system to confront drone threats and remotely controlled systems by jamming their navigation system. The ability to jam most frequency bands, the ability to operate in all operational areas and battlefields, rapid deployment, duration of operation, intelligent operation and having no need to operators are the capabilities of the system. Iran's powerful Revolutionary Guard force has managed to fly a surveillance drone over the USS Nimitz aircraft carrier which last week transited through the Strait of Hormuz, an Iranian news agency has reported. The semi-official Tasnim news agency, which is considered close to the paramilitary guard, published images of the Nimitz, saying they were taken by Iranian-made drones and showing fighter planes parked on the carrier's deck. The Nimitz and several other warships passed last Friday through the Strait of Hormuz, the world's most important choke point for oil shipments, the U.S. Navy had said, in what was described as a scheduled maneuver. The U.S. Navy's Bahrain-based Fifth Fleet, which oversees patrols across Mideast waters, declined to comment the Iranian report on Wednesday. Earlier in the day, the Guard took over a delivery of surveillance drones from Iran's defense industries. At a ceremony marking the event, Gen Hossein Salami said the power of the Guard's navy stems from its combination use of drones, helicopters, aircraft and its vessels. Over the past decade, the Guard has occasionally published images on the U.S. vessels in the Persian Gulf, where the force has been in charge of protecting Iran's interests since 2007. In 2019, similar images were published, reportedly from a Guard drone that flew over the USS Dwight D. Eisenhower and another American warship in the Persian Gulf.
tensions between Iran and the U.S. continue to simmer. The U.S. withdrew from the 2015 nuclear deal between Iran and major world powers and imposed new tougher sanctions on Iran that sent the country's economy into free fall. We are in war, we are in an economic war, said Hassan Rouhani, Iran's president, in a cabinet meeting on Wednesday, citing the U.S. sanctions as the cause of the economic warfare. Thank you.